Okay, everyone. How's everybody doing? Let me get... Hey, man. Listen, you guys made me so proud of the last video. You know, um, I got a shout out to give out. Well, a couple of them. Um, I like to shout out my wife first and foremost. You know, she's been supporting me from day one. Donnie V, you know who you are. My boy Donnie V's supporting me too. And we got some new people. Um, shout out to uh, Bangham Smurf from Ohio. Yes, yes, yes. Let's give it up from Ohio. And let me see if I can get it right. It's Gen Gen 43-ver? Gen 43-ver? I don't know. It's G-E-N 43-V-E-R. I guess it is. Let's give a shout out to him. He is from Rome, Italy. Yes, 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 yes. International people. And on to KK. My cousin KK. Hey, KK. We're going to get you on YouTube because promote your stuff. Hey, get on YouTube. Mm. And you have the next dude's Daniel. Daniel, salute to Daniel from LA, California. You know, thank you for chiming in. Thank you for support. And keep rocking out with those drums. I know you're a drummer, man. Yeah, rock out with those drums. And next is uh, Steve, excuse me, Stefan, Stefan Wilson. Stefan Wilson, you didn't say where you were from. Um, shout out to you. Uh, Jay Bone, shout out to you for checking in. You know, thank you, sir. Uh, Martin Crabtree. Martin Crabtree from the UK, the United Kingdom. Yes, yes, yes. London. I see you there. You know, have a splice of tea for me. You know, and uh, my boy, Maurice Walker. Thank you, guys, man. You guys, you know. Definitely put a smile on my face when I said, I said, ah, look, look, look. You know, everybody check out uh, Maurice Walker also. He got a lot of dope joints going on, you know. Shout out to him. And, you know, like last week, y'all know the... And you just gonna walk right in while making a video, huh? Look at this guy. Man, go sit. You know what? Go, go back, dude. This guy always doing stuff. Hey, you know... On to the first piece, like before, you know, we got five pieces. Mm-hmm. A little parched. So, this first piece is a nice, like, I like this. It's actually this hand-woven joint with the American flag. Of course, you know, has the RL stitch in it. RL 67. Hyphen, excuse, hyphen, 67, you know, it is what it is, you're going to see me with this on a lot, you know, partying it up, you know, doing the funky worm, yeah, yeah, somebody asked me, said, what's the funky worm, hey, man, whatever, whatever it is that you do, and on to this piece, you know, I just, I snagged this up, you know, it's not even my size. It's not my size. And it's a nice strong piece, you know. I I like it. If it was in my oh, don't show the prices. You know the tag is still on. You know, this is a nice piece. You know, it's a large. And you know, it's gonna be a lot of people out there trying to get rid of these pieces that do have them. They're gonna try to to to, to jack up the prices. You know, you want it, you know, I'll let it go for a reasonable price. It's not going to kill your pockets. Actually, this thing right here, it turns into a vest. I mean, excuse me, this vest turns into a, a pouch. Got the right pocket? Yeah. Yeah, so you just pull all this stuff out. And, and look at there. You can see on the inside, it has the pony on it. It has the polo. That's the polo man of the horse. You see that? Flip. I'm not doing that right now. You know, on to piece number three. Uh-oh. What am I doing? Okay, yeah. Piece number three. Now, I got this piece. I was so excited. I was like, whoa. I'm going to be styling out with this. I got a whole outfit to go with this. Find out. Bam! 
It's too small for me. It's a nice, it's a nice rugged piece. I mean, I got it for low. I mean, low. You know, I got it for little to nothing. And it's a nice hard piece. I just like how, you know, the orange, and, you know, the orange and the camel goes together. Should I? Can't fit it though. You know, it's supposedly a, a 2X. I mean, excuse me, a XL. Supposedly. So, we're on to piece number four. Piece number four. It's plain. It's real plain, but I like it because you know, it's plain. It's rugged. It has this this rugged texture feel with the you know with the kind of like the knitted feel right here. It's dope though. I mean, it has a a, a a hood inside the jacket. Inside the collar, I mean. Excuse me. I'm a little crazy today and of course you know it's, it's the Ralph it's a lot plain but it's just a get up and go piece you know it's really really plain you know grown man type you want to put something on that's light and you know don't want to attract too much attention to yourself you got all these patches in different colors you know and on to this last piece. I got this last piece for like, I had this for a while now. I never, never showcased it. Maybe because it's, it's going into winter now. It's trying to pull out all the big stuff. I don't know. I got some more. That's, I think I might, got an idea. I might do a winter showcase piece, you know? Yeah, I, I don't know. Might be over the top. You let me know. Let me know down in the comments what should I do. See, now on to this piece. It's a nice little ski vest, you know. I like it. I've wore it a lot. Well, not as I wanted to wear it last year. But this piece, like the hood, detaches, has a drawstring in the back. The hood, you know. This is very noticeable piece is very bright and it's always is is really lightweight you know it's very very lightweight and i like it it's mine <laughs> shout out to my boy raymo raymo's guy is crazy you know it's awful also ralph right here you know i like it it got a lot of weird little features to it you know a lot of feathers, I know that. A lot of feathers everywhere. So everybody, once again, we have come to the end of the video. Everybody be blessed. Have a great week and be prosperous. Peace.